What's up guys? Welcome to another Scratch tutorial. This is part 2 on how to make a snake game in Scratch. And in this video, we'll be looking at how to make the food for the player to eat and grow longer. So anyways, without further ado, let's get started. So here's the code from last time, and if you haven't seen part 1 yet, you can check it out, links in description. But first, I'm going to create a new sprite, which I will call Food. And I'm also going to call this costume Food. And select the paintbrush tool, I'm going to set this to 20. And then you just click once, and now you have a circle. You can just make your own circle by using the circle tool, but I think this way is easier. And then just make it the color red. Okay, so I'm going to drag a one green flag clicked, and I'm going to make sure it hides because we're going to use clones. So make sure that original sprite hides. And then I'm going to drag a forever loop and a wait one seconds block. And wait, pick random 0.0, .0 to 1.0 seconds. And then create clone of myself. And then I'm going to drag a when I set clone and a show. And I'm going to drag a set color effect to block and this will also be random so negative 200 to 200 and then i'm going to go to motion and drag a go to random position so then next i'm going to go and drag a forever loop and if statement and check if touching player then i'm going to wait zero seconds change length by 1 and delete this clone. I'm actually going to put this change length by 1 over the wait 0 seconds. So it hides, it waits um, a random seconds and then I'll create the clone and then when it starts the clone it's going to go to random position and it's going to be a random color. So if I click this, as you can see, the color changes. And then, if it's touching the player, then you change the length so it'll grow longer. So I'm going to test this out. See, we got some dots around. As you can see, the length goes up if I collect some of these. And... I grow longer, which is exactly what I want. And you can't really tell, so what I'm going to do is inside here, I need to make this smaller. So I'm going to set the size to, um, so 70 over here, I want this to be maybe 50. So now I'm smaller. And then I can go longer. Which is exactly what I want. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next Scratch tutorial. Peace out.